Well, Fox 26 is your Gulf Coast Weather Authority, and we have meteorologist Adrian Vaughn. Adrian, it doesn't take you long to sweat out. <laughs> You're exactly right. Uh, today, though, was the first day this week that we did not make it up to the century mark. Official high temperature today, 96. I know we'll take any little victory we can at this point. Uh, what helped us today was the clouds and the rain that we picked up here across parts of the area, and some locations really got in on a decent dose. Some spots north of the woodlands extending up towards Huntsville on the order of an inch, an inch and a half there, and some locations closer to two inches of rain here today. So some good news. We certainly need more, but does not look like a whole lot is coming down the pipeline for us in the next couple of days. We do still have a little bit of rain out there, but most of this activity right now still on the very light side uh, from spring up towards Conroe and then extending northward up towards the Huntsville area. There is still that light shower activity, but the rain, as mentioned, has kept our temperatures down. And right now we're sitting in the 70s. Dayton, Conroe at 76. We're at 79 Bush right now. It's mid 80s from the metro extending out towards Tomball, 83 in Sugarland, where they've got bright sunshine and dry conditions. It's mid and upper 90s, close to 100 degrees in a few spots out towards the Brazos Valley. Tomorrow, temperatures again. Again, going to be sizzling hot. We'll close in on 98 for the afternoon high, but once you add in the humidity, we'll be looking at those heat index values between 100 and 105. It's a partly sunny day with an isolated shower thunderstorm chance out there for us as we head throughout the course of the day. And as mentioned, those feels like temperatures going to be even hotter as we get through the afternoon. So here's what it looks like as we head through your Saturday. It's just an isolated hit or miss shower thunderstorm chance out there. Not everyone gets involved in the activity, but those that do get in on some rain cool air and it will feel a little bit better for a short amount of time. Into Sunday, a rinse and repeat scenario with again some hit or miss showers and thunderstorms. Otherwise, it's sunshine with those hot conditions continuing here across the region. Highs into the upper 90s both Saturday and Sunday. Looks like we'll touch off right at 100 on Monday. But then as we get towards the middle to end of the week, a pattern change starting to shift in. We'll start to look at better rain chances and temperatures. They won't be quite as extreme.